Hey guys, Richard here. So in this video, I want to talk to you about how to use Warrior Plus. Now, if you follow my channel for a while, you'll know that a lot of the products I actually review are from Warrior Plus, and some of them aren't the best quality, but there are some good products on Warrior Plus that you can go ahead and promote. So this is going to be a very, very honest look at the Warrior Plus platform, and I'm going to take you through exactly how you go ahead and find some good offers to promote, and then show you some ways at the end of the video, how you can actually go ahead and drive traffic over to your promotions so that you can go ahead and make commissions. So just before we start guys, my name is Richard. This is the School of Nomads. If you haven't been over to my channel before, go ahead and hit the subscribe with the notification bell and I'll let you know whenever I release new videos. And guys, if you're really looking to build a long-term sustainable business online, don't forget to check out my link in the description below over to a completely free resource that it'll get you started straight away. So let's jump straight into Warrior Plus and I'm gonna show you how this actually all works. So as you can see, I'm over on the Warrior Plus platform. If you haven't been over it before, you just need to go ahead and sign up. Uh, use your details when you sign up for these types of networks. Just go ahead and give it your login details and then we can just go ahead and log straight in. So here we are over on the home screen of Warrior Plus now. There's various things you can do with Warrior Plus. One, it's a marketplace. So you can come here and just look for products to buy and you can purchase them straight from this marketplace. Second thing is you can be a vendor and you can go ahead and create products and then advertise them on this network. And then the third thing, and the thing that most people really use this for is you can be an affiliate and you can come along and look at products and then actually promote those products and earn money. Now. I'm gonna take this from an affiliate angle because this is very much aimed at beginners and beginners usually don't have products to sell. So let's look at this from an affiliate point of view first. I'm gonna show you how you can go ahead and find decent products that you can go and promote. So the first thing is you'll see down here, there's a long list of products. Now these are the current products that are being released today. And all you need to do is click into any of these. If you actually click into this top piece here, you go ahead to the view the product itself. So let's go and have a look at this one. And this is actual product by Billy Dar, and I know this one because I've actually reviewed it myself. Now I'm not actually gonna comment on the quality of these products at the moment. I just want you to see the kind of functions of Warrior Plus itself. Now, next thing I can actually go ahead and look at the vendor it, that this product comes from. So this one, Digital Page Designs. If we just click on their name, you'll be able to see this vendor and all of the other products they've actually released. So you'll see here, this is they're pretty prolific in, in the amount of releases they do. So you look at here, here's all of the actual products that they've released. And there is a indication of how these products are actually being received by the users. So you'll see here, there's a star rating here that people can come along and do reviews. And I would usually take the, the, the ones with more actual reviews on rather than less, because obviously that can be skewed quite a bit and you can see on this particular vendor uh, the star ratings are very low and I know that because he releases a lot of rubbish into the market but I'm going to leave that for now because I want to talk to you about how to find the real quality of a product as we go through so I just jump back to the dashboard now again is all of your list of products that have been released um, recently so this is today's top products and this is yesterday's and then last seven days, and then you can see last 30 days, all of these products have been released recently. Um, on the right hand side here, you have uh, links to the marketplace, which is up here. Any kind of product alerts. So these are the kind of advertisements for new products. Vendors here, affiliate section there, deal of the day here, and then help and support. Now deal of the day is this one here. You usually see something advertised up here. So world's best push button app for unlimited free traffic. Sounds really cool. That's the deal of the day. You can click on there and go ahead and look at that. Now that's how you kind of find these on the front screen. Now if you go into the marketplace itself, you have various sections. So I go to home. And this is where, again, you find a full list of all of the different products on this network. Now it can be confusing because there's a lot of them, but what you need to do is some research here and start figuring out what are the types of vendors that you want to advertise? Because you can go a number of ways on Warrior Plus. You can either come in here and just grab anything that's popular and try and make money off it, or you can come in here and look for some quality stuff to actually release to your audience. Now, I, I prefer the second option because I think it's a more long-term business online, but you see a lot of people online just grabbing any old product and trying to earn a few dollars from it. It's up to you guys. I'm not telling you how to run your business, but 
I know how I like to actually do it. You can actually come along here and put a keyword in for a particular offer there and search it by keyword, or you can search it by vendor. Now I know a couple of good vendors, so I'm gonna just gonna say JK. I'll search by that, and then I should end up with that vendors. Like a JK Dowdle, these are that vendors, various products, and I can actually go ahead and research some of these products. So this Essential Pages is a very good one he did recently. I'm gonna click into here, and I can look at what this actual Essential Pages is. And then I can determine whether this is something that I want to go ahead and promote. Now if I just go back, I'm actually gonna click on JK's name here, and I'm gonna show you, again, the types of products that somebody like JK actually releases. And this will give you a good indication of the types of people that you can follow online. So you can see most of his star ratings are fours, fours, um, there's Destiny here is a four, Facebook Masters programs are five, and overall he's got a four out of 196 reviews. So other things on the marketplace, you've got the top products here, and it'll actually explain to you which are the top products currently being sold on the network. Again, these are quick ways to kind of analyze the types of products on here. So again, the top sellers don't always mean that these are quality products, but these are the actual folks that are selling the most on the network at the moment. You can come to categories and it gives you a good way of actually searching by category. So if you had a certain niche that you were going after, you can come along here and have a look at the various categories. So let's say I wanted to look at graphics and video creation. You could actually come along here and have a look at all these various products around graphics and video creation. Again, it's just a case of searching through, looking at the various reviews and just making sure that these are nice quality products that you're looking at. A lot of these seem to be around the kind of low content book publishing world. So you might want to look at something slightly different, but lots and lots of different types of categories on here. Next thing is alerts. So this would tell you if there was any kind of news that was coming on at the moment. So these are actually the uh, vendors themselves sending out messages and most of the time telling you they've got something new that you can promote. And the last thing is deal of the day. And we saw this deal up here. Uh, they'll actually give you more in information about what this deal of the day is. So that's the marketplace. I'm going to skip the vendor, but if you're a vendor on here, you have all sorts of functions that this will do for you. So it gives you a place that you can actually add your offers and your products. You can share products here. You have a list of customers. You've got your transactions information here. You've got your stats. You've got your sales reports. You can have all your list of your affiliates and your affiliate contests in here. So it's pretty much all inclusive for vendors. Now, if affiliates, if you're an affiliate on here, you have a main dashboard here. Now what this main dashboard does is show you all of your earnings from the last 30 days. Now I don't actually promote anything on Warrior Plus currently. All of my stuff's on pay kickstart. But when you do promote, this is where the actual amount of money that you're earning will actually show for you. Now if I show the kind of overall stats before I go to offers, and you see here, these are the overall stats that you get. So this is a very detailed view. The dashboard view was a very high level view. Now you can see here, there's various products on here. Now if I just have a look at kind of this, this one, Destiny, um, these are the number of hops you got in the time period that you've chosen. This is the hop conversion rate. So out of my 16 hops, I got six sales, that's 37%. Uh, dollars per hop is $14. Dollars per sale is $39 and total is $239. So for every hop, I've earned $14, which is pretty good. And it shows this is a very, very high converting offer. Now there is other stuff on here that is slightly lower uh, because there are very, very small offers. But you know, this gives you an indication of how successful your campaigns are. So this is all the details of your stuff. And again, I haven't really promoted anything on here for a while because my current products that I'm promoting are on a different affiliate network. But if you come along here, this is where you'll find your data. I'll just go down to the launch calendar here. And this will give you an indication of all of the different things that are being launched on Warrior Plus. Um, again, so many different things are being launched all the time. Your tricky thing here is to start thinking about how you can find vendors that you like to promote. This is where you need to do some investigation 
look at the vendor profiles like I showed you and then figure out who are the types of folks you actually want to promote. And then lastly, if you go to your offers, this is where you can actually find affiliate links. So this is the most important thing, obviously, if you want to start promoting things. And this is where all of the existing affiliate links are that you have already requested. And there's also a list of products here that you can go ahead and request affiliate links for. So again, I'm just gonna go find one particular vendor just because I know this is gonna be a good product if I go for one of these. So for instance, if I wanted to go ahead and promote any of this vendor's products, I would come down to the product itself and you just go ahead and click request. And if you click request, there's a number of things you'll see on this actual page. One is the overall vendor stats, so you can see um, how many products of this particular offer have been sold, what the price range is, what your commissions are gonna be, 33 to $169. If I go to the actual funnel map, this will show you the actual funnel itself, and you'll be able to see exactly what this funnel looks like. And then if I go to the actual products, you'll be able to see the price of each of the products. So this is how much the actual products within that funnel actually cost. So it gives you a good idea of how much commission you could possibly make by promoting this type of product. So you go ahead and you request approval. Now you have certain ways that you can go ahead and get paid here. You can go directly paid through PayPal. Most people get it paid to the Warrior Plus wallet now and then they can request the funds at a later date. They'll ask you that information when you first sign up, what your kind of bank details are, etc. But what you need to do here is actually say a few words to the vendor. So if you're completely new, it is kind of tricky to get approval for products that have been launched very, very recently because the vendors are trying to protect the earnings per click rate so that bigger affiliates will actually come on board and promote the offer. So you as a very small beginner affiliate might have a few issues. As you go along, it does become a lot easier to get approved, especially if you can show them proof of earnings on other networks. So for this one, you would just say a few words to the vendor and it would also be a good idea to put a little video together and explain what you're trying to do and how you would like to promote this. So five minute video, just explain who you are, what you're trying to do, why you want to promote this offer. And it does work wonders if the vendors can see that you're at least making an effort and then you're more likely to be approved. So I'm just gonna say a few words here. So all I've done there is just a quick line there. I won't do a video because I actually know the vendor myself on this particular one and I have promoted other products of his, but just a quick line there then just press request offer now. Again, if you're completely new and he doesn't know you from Adam, you would actually you know, put a bit more effort into this and make sure he really understands who you are. And then you just request the offer. Now, some of them take a while to come back. Some of them are automatically approved if they are not being launched at the time. So it all depends whether those products are kind of brand new or evergreen. And most of the evergreen ones you likely to get approval for because by that time, they're just happy that they're getting more regular sales. So again, you can come here and spend time going through the various vendors, have a look at the types of products that they promote, and the easiest way to do that is by going over to the sales page. You have a look at the sales page. Now, if this is already being released, all you would do is obviously come and I would buy it, because if you're gonna promote this to others, I'd wanna know what it is and what kind of information was in it. So you can go ahead and buy this product on the front end. Now you know what the upsells are through Warrior Plus, so you might not want to buy them, but at least for this particular product, it may be worth actually purchasing the front end so that you really understand what it is. Now, if they are brand new products, you can usually go to a site called Munchai. If you watch my next video, I'm actually gonna show you how to use Munchai to find out a little bit more about some of these products. But in the case of this one, as it's been out for a while, it's probably not on Munchai anymore. So I would go ahead and buy the front end so that you have a good idea of what it's all about. So let's have a look at how you can actually get people over to see your offers that you're finding on Warrior Plus. So what I have here is a very, very typical funnel that you will see whenever you go searching for one of these types of products online. Now, what you would have is various traffic sources. So on the left-hand side here, you could have, I don't know, TikTok, you could have YouTube, which is a traffic source I use all the time. You could have Facebook, you'd have Instagram, you could have Pinterest. Now, what you have on, let's say YouTube as an example, you would have a video that could be a review, or it could be 
a video around the topic of the actual product itself that you get people to come along and watch. So once people come along and actually watch your video, they can click on the button in the description and then they'll go over to some form of landing page or it could be a review page. This landing page and this review page has the details of the product that you're trying to promote and then you have a way that you can click on a button over to the Warrior Press product itself and then you go ahead and they may purchase that product. That's one way to do it and that's the way that a lot of people do this type of marketing, especially if it's in the launch period and it's kind of called launch jacking. Now, if a product is evergreen, you can do a slightly different thing. And in the long term, you will actually end up making more sales and being able to benefit in a much better way. If a product is more evergreen, which means it's been around for a while and it's here and it's established, you can actually put a landing page here rather than go straight to the review and collect email addresses with some kind of lead magnet or a promise of some bonuses, they can actually give you their email address and go on your autoresponder. Now, the big benefit of that is if they don't go over to Warrior Plus, obviously make that purchase, they'll always be on your autoresponder. Now, people could be very, very busy all the time. There's, they've got kids, they're going to work, they're looking at things on mobiles. They're not always going to buy the product first time. But if you can get their email address, you can then promote to them on the back end. You can have a series of value emails that go out. You can have promotion emails that go out. And then eventually they'll come back and they be in, might be interested in that product or a different product that you're promoting and make that purchase off you. So this is a much better way that you can go ahead and do promotions. The launch jacking method, which is really get the traffic, come over to a review page, go over to Warrior Plus product and then don't buy it is very very limited sometimes because you do lose those people forever this is a more sustained way to build a business now if you look at the link in the description below over to my free training i actually show you how to actually set this process up but for the purposes of this video i'm just trying to highlight that it doesn't really matter what kind of traffic source you have and i would just pick one of them and really build it up the main thing is looking at how you can actually capture people in the longer term so that you can actually provide value for them and then occasionally promote quality products and services to them that are going to be beneficial. And in the long term, you'll have a more sustainable business online, guys. So guys, I hope you found that useful. In my next video, I'm actually going to show you where you can find out even more information about some of these products on Warrior Plus and a trick that you can actually use to find out information about products that have been released for a while where on warrior plus sometimes it is hard to figure out what that product's all about without actually purchasing it so look out for that one my name is richard darby this is the school of nomads if you haven't been to the channel before please don't forget to hit the subscribe and notification bell it allows me to tell you exactly when i release my new videos and if you are looking to build a long-term sustainable business online go ahead and check out the link in the description below over to the school of nomads and we'll take you through the whole process step by step. Until next time, guys, take care.